something may look a little different to you guys. Snowmageddon happened overnight last night here. Oh my gosh, and it is 15 degrees. That's without the wind chill temperature. The wind chill is in single digits, and it is very windy today. <laughs> I know I am crazy, but eh, you know, I always have the best luck whenever it's crazy weather, so I figure let's do it. I better have good luck today or I'm gonna be super salty. <laughs> Thankfully, I have so many hand warmers, back warmers, feet warmers, toe warmers, you name it, I got it. Because a few of you have sent me those, I think it was last year, or maybe even the year before, and I still have so many. So, I am going to be prepared today. I will be warm and toasty. I have extra socks, extra sweatpants. I, of course, have on long johns underneath. I'm ready to go. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to pump myself up, but I'm really not looking forward to this. <laughs> I got to be honest. I am not looking forward to this. I hate being cold. I'm not going to lie. I absolutely despise it. But, like I always say, these things in the dumpsters aren't going to save themselves. So, that being said, let's head on out to these dumpsters and do the dang thing. All right, guys. First dumpster of the day. Dollar General. All right. Let me take y'all out and show you what we're working with. Oh, no. I think I forgot my freaking tripod. Son of a bee. That's all right. I'll just take y'all out and show you real quick and put you back in the car. Look at all this snow, guys. Crazy, isn't it? Do you see all this? <laughs> oh my God. Is that a whole freaking case of Chef Boy RD? Oh my gosh, guys. We got three, four packs of fat food. That's amazing in itself right there. That was worth coming out in snowmageddon. <laughs> Absolutely. That is so amazing for the cats. Plus we have a whole tote filled with goodies. We have a whole case of marshmallows, which will be great for the school district kids. And we have all these little sausages and a whole case of Chef Boyardee. Plus this whole bag is filled with goodies. And we got some mystery boxes. Oh, child, I am so excited. Let me warm these tootsies up because they're frozen. <laughs> there was nothing at Home Goods, So I'm gonna check Burlington. I can see stuff sticking out of the top. So might be a good idea to check this one.
there's a lot more in there, but it's all broke. So. Let me check Old Navy real quick. They normally destroy everything, but I still want to check just in case. We're at a DG. There's nobody in that truck, so let's go check. I got a bunch of goodies from that one. So exciting. We're inside the Walgreens dumpster. Gotta be quiet and fast. It's pretty much all empty boxes. But we do have some slippers. Oh, bag of kitty litter. Alright, let's go get the rest. How stinking cute is that? The bag is ripping, of course. That just needs glued, I can fix that. We got a bunch of drink mixes, and I gotta get a bag so I can get the rest of the stuff because the bag is falling apart, of course, because it's a Dollar General garbage bag. <laughs> oh my gosh, how freaking cute is that too? And these are filled with juice boxes. Perfect for the school district kids, yes! I grabbed the rest of the stuff that was in the bag that ripped. We are at CVS and there is one bag in here that has some goodies. So let's see if I can hold you, hold the lid and grab it. That's what my head's for, right? There's some goodies in there. Oh, icy pads, our panty liners. We're just gonna grab the whole bag. Next DG, we got two more left after this. Oh my God, everything is a sheet of ice underneath the snow. Oh, those look like garbage cans. I forgot to put my gloves on. No, they're toads. No freaking way. All right, let me get my gloves. Oh man, I gotta pee so bad. <laughs> All right, let me put y'all in the car so I can use both my hands since I'm so sorry I forgot my tripod. Through my body, I know that it is here to stay. It's like you're my personal Illuminati I know that some might say that I am just a bad girl But if you treat me right I will be the best girl in this whole world No, I'm not gonna fight I got my hands on your body So tell me, tell me what you want me to do I can be good or be not it All right. 
right, peeps, we at the last DG. Okay, doesn't look frozen, so that's a plus. All right, let's see if I can grab as much as I can before somebody comes out. <laughs> Full, baby <laughs> she's full holy cow I cannot wait I'm sorry it's so cold my camera does not want to focus I cannot wait to show you guys everything I got I was having so many camera issues plus I forgot my tripod so I am so very sorry about that guys but at least we have the full reveal so you guys can actually see everything I pulled out of those dumpsters so that being said let's dive on in most of this came from the DGs, which is, of course, my favorite dumpster. Y'all know that. We have four four packs of Frisky's cat food back there. They are not expired. Somebody did mention in my short that I uploaded that they may be on recall. I did look it up and I did not see anything. So... I will continue to look before I donate that, absolutely. We also got a full case of Chef Boyardee that is not expired. The best buy date is May of 2025. No idea why they threw those out. We also have a full case of the Armour Sausages. Again, these are not expired. Not until October 19th of 2025. So much candy, it is straight crazy. We have Nerds, Twix, Paydays, Nestle Crunches, Hershey's, Reese's Miniatures, Butterfingers, tons of M&Ms. You get it. You see it. Holy cow, it's a lot. We also have all of these juice boxes, V8 energy drinks, some Kool-Aids, ton of the Crystal Light. No need for those to be in the trash. None of them are expired. Super cute home signs. That little clock. Face masks. Bubble bath tampons, four of these neon sign kits, which are super cool, a snowball launcher, Barbie and LOL colored pens, pencils, a bottle, tons of little boy socks, three bottles of Windex, two dish soaps, a Febreze, a wall trimmer, containers, still wrapped in the plastic, a wallet, toothpaste, Dixie plates, a huge bag of cat litter, a whole case of marshmallows, which again, are not expired. I found a whole Christmas tree in the trash. At Burlington, I got three pictures. One of them was completely damaged. I could not fix it, but we do have the two Chanel back there. I mean, this is absolutely crazy how much I found in these dumpsters. It that that's not even expired that's the killer i could see if it was out of date and you can't put it on the shelf that, just no need no flipping need i also stopped at a cvs and i started going through the bag and i was like you know what i'm just gonna take the whole flipping thing i'll go through it at home so let's go through this together and let's see what goodies are in the cvs bag we have a slot machine bank, a 148 carefree panty liners. There is a rip, of course, at the top, but these are individually wrapped. So nothing got in them. They were inside of a closed bag. So these are absolutely going to be a great donation for the period packs for Miss Tara. Also have a package of always panty liners. They're always finding these heating pads at CVS. I don't know why they always throw them away. I'm guessing they're returns and they can't put them back on the shelf, but everybody needs themselves a heating pad. Aquaphor advanced therapy. Little bell lights. How cute are those? Ton of AAA batteries in the bottom of this bag. Here's the package for the batteries. So it literally just opened, so they threw it away. Rest is all trash. So not too bad out of CVS. I also found a ton of totes, guys. There is absolutely not one of these totes that is broken. This one just pops out a little extra, but I got all the lids. We got these two at that $1 general. They are a little bit dirty, but I'll wash them out. They don't have lids, don't need them. 
I use them to donate stuff in. Of course, we found the whole Christmas tree at Old Navy. <laughs> Crazy. A whole four pack of puffs plus lotion Kleenex. And we have some mystery boxes. So I'm super excited to go through those with you. I'll go through those in a minute. Tons of soda. Of course, we are always forever finding pop in the dumpsters. Now, I am going to show you, and myself, because I have no idea yet, what is inside these mystery boxes that we pulled out of those dumpsters. So, let's find out together. Box number one. It says Valentine's plush stand unicorn. Why in the world are they throwing out Valentine's Day stuff? It hasn't even happened yet. Why would they throw these away? <laughs> that makes me so angry. But we have six brand new Valentine's Day unicorns. Box number two, more Valentine's Day stuff. Unbelievable. These were $3 each. We have Let Love Grow, Love You More with a little key. We have another Let Love Grow. And then we have this XOXO one. I just broke it trying to get it out of the box. So I will super glue that back together before I donate it. All right, next up we have, oh, a whole flipping box of gummy bears. Ruby space triangles? I have no idea, so let's find out together. Oh, okay, I get it. We have a four pack of these space triangles. I've never even seen these. Those are really cool. Those would be super nice. $10 each. And they just threw them in the trash. Last box. Let's see what we got in this one. If I can open it. We have a whole box of crystal light drink pouches. That is flipping awesome. That is gonna do it for me, guys. That is absolutely everything that I found in the dumpsters and I could not be happier with this score. We found so much amazing stuff. We have stuff to donate to the school district kids, stuff to take to the Blackburn Center, stuff to take to the Women and Children Center. I mean, there's just so much here. It's crazy. And all of this would have went to the trash. That's what blows my mind. Perfectly good stuff, food, drinks, clothing, stuffed animals, decor, all would have went to the trash. That ugh, burns my biscuits, okay? But that is gonna do it for me, guys. Thank you so very much for hanging out with me at the dumpsters on that bitter cold day. And today in the reveal, I, of course, will talk to you all in those comments down below. And until next time, happy diving.